first thing for setting up the, the total station to transfer is we have this uh, serial to USB adapter and sometimes it registers as a different COM port so we have to go to device manager device manager open that and then you go to uh, the COM ports and you see what what number it is so it's COM3 and then you open the connect software which is on the SARL server it's uh, just a .exe so it doesn't actually install you just put it on a folder on your on your uh, desktop and you go in here and you go to transfer settings and you make sure that under uh, the transfer it's it's you use the DTM 500 slash 501 502 series even though this is a NPL 352 I don't know why but that's that works and then um, on the COM port you set it to COM port 3 9600 baud rate and none for parity and the rest of these defaults are usually just fine okay so then to actually download stuff you have to go to your menu and uh, select a job and open it so I've got one there called VU ref I'll just um, enter on that so it opens that job so now that job's open I go in the menu again and I go to com and I go to download but on this side here I have to go to transfer get job from total station and then you can download raw or download coordinates and usually I try to do raw first because that downloads all the metadata that the instrument tags into the file itself so there's just a lot more data in it um, otherwise coordinates is literally just XYZ point number and code number um, so I'm going to hit download raw here and it's like sitting here waiting so you have to do it on this side first it's waiting I go download and that says vref that's job name format is Nikon data is raw and you can scroll down through these and right arrow to, to change it from coordinates to raw so we're at raw so I'm going to hit enter and then you hit go and then on this side it starts to pull them down so then it saves that as or it comes in as a dot crj I believe or cxj is the um, file format and um, on this side you can save it out as just coordinates um, and I'll show you how to do that okay so that's all set so I'm just going to save this first and then I can go to um, should we just export oh here we go export export uh, ASCII which is a text file okay so then you have to actually just like select it all and uh, comma delimited is fine so I just hit export here and I'm gonna um, steal that same name for it and just uh, take off the extension and it'll save it as a text file that's it